Show that y is equal to x over 2x minus 5 is a decreasing function for all values of x except x is equal to 5 over 2. Now the x is 5 over 2 comes by substituting that in here and we get dividing by 0. So the function doesn't actually exist. Uh, x is equal to 5 over 2. Now if we draw a graph to visualise the uh, problem, and you use GeoGebra to draw this, okay, we can see that here the gradient of this graph will always be negative for every single value of x so what we've got to do is to show that the gradient is negative for every single value of x except 5 over 2 where the graph isn't defined because that's a vertical asymptote so to find the gradient function we will need to differentiate so we've got y is equal to x over 2x minus 5 that's type u over v so if we let u be equal to x, du by dx will be 1. v is 2x minus 5, and if we differentiate that, we're just going to get 2. So using the quotient rule, and the quotient rule says dy by dx is v du by dx minus u dv by dx over v squared. So substituting in these values, we've got v, which is 2x minus 5, in brackets, times uh, du by dx, which is 1, minus u, which is x, times dv by dx, which is 2, over v squared, which is 2x minus 5, all squared. So, writing that out again. Right, simplifying the denominator, we, uh, sorry, the numerator, okay, this one here, we're going to have 2x minus 5 minus 2x over 2x uh, minus 5 squared, 2x minus 2x, they cancel each other out. So we're just left with minus 5 over 2x minus 5 all squared. Now, 2x minus 5 all squared, it doesn't matter what the value of x, provided it's not equal to 5 over 2, is always going to be positive. If that is always positive, then all we're going to uh, have to deal with, the fact is we've got minus 5 in the numerator, which is always negative because it's not, in, it's not dependent on x. So if this is positive, the numerator will always be uh, negative. So the denominator is greater than zero, i.e. 2x minus 5 all squared will be greater than zero for any value of x, x not equal to 5 over 2. And therefore, far, minus 5 over 2x minus 5 all squared will be less than zero because it will just be left with minus 5 for all values of x except x is equal to 5 over 2. And going back to the graph, we can see that the graph is the gradient on this graph is always negative. That means the function is decreasing over all values of x except 5 over 2. Okay, I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.